I'm Nachi Virasuria. I'm manager of business development at SKM Lanka. In my uh, right side is Mr. Manju Kumar Singer. He's a, a deputy uh, CEO and chief operational officer. Manju, what do you think about the market today? And overall, we will take the last week. Yeah, if you really see today uh, is a significant uh, drop, almost uh, close to 100 points, uh, which was quite uh, significant in terms of steepness in the uh, activity. Uh, I, I feel in my opinion the, there is a little bit of panic set in, in the market right now because there can be a lot of uh, emerging calls that have come and then uh, what our people have seen is you know you buy a stock and wait for one or two three days to see where the direction is. Uh, no sooner uh, they realize that the direction is more towards downward they would like to cut uh, you know cut losses and uh, whatever you know require their investments or the capital uh, now when you look at the last couple of days or last weeks the market have been continuously and consistently coming down that is actually a uh, not a good sign so that is why people are just selling off and holding on to whatever that they could uh, i mean i don't think that's a kind of a substantial drawback or fallback uh, it is an opportunity for someone who has cash to move in because uh, this market is quite uh, indigenous. Our market is quite, uh, you know, um, kind of a special, special market. Uh, we certainly have certain limitations. We certainly have certain characteristics which are uh, relevant only to stock market. You find some stocks are illiquid and also most of the investors are quite used to uh, hold a stock, if the stock is going to go up and then ride the wave, but whenever they see the stock market is going to go down, they have no faith, whatever whatever the money that they could recover, they will start, you know, realizing that. So, I feel very soon there can be a sort of a uh, U-turn and no sooner U-turn happens, you find a lot of people are, you know, joining the bandwagon. So, this is kind of, you know, merry-go-round story. Uh, which 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 goes down also has to go up subsequently. The way that we say whatever that goes up has to come down. Similarly, whatever that goes down, I'm sure there will be a rubber ball effect uh, in the stock market also. It should really rebound soon because relatively the earnings and the fundamentals haven't changed. And I think the growth forecast and the uh, de development drives of the government are all in place. Uh, it's a matter of time. You mean that at the moment is selling pressure? It's, uh, yes, because uh, mostly, you know, even the most of the institution of institutions are staying away from the market. Uh, all this time, they have been giving a bit of a comfort and uh, buying shares and creating sort of a uh, sort of a flow. But no sooner some of these big time investors move out, uh, even the fun fundamental stocks can come down because there is no support. That is why you find even uh, blue chips uh, started to you know deteriorate gradually, but not in substantial way. But stocks that have gone up uh, without you know reasons, uh, with certain people's aspect uh, you know aspirations without a reason have come down substantially. So that's why we say people to book in profits whenever they could, uh, especially on stocks that has no growth potential. But if there are growth potential, start you know. Uh, stick to a strike price, even if it goes down, start collecting.